I went to Jack Benny shows. I loved it. I did it every week. Did you have a reserved seat in the theater for yourself? No, and I backstage. Never sat in the theater. I always sat back. I was always with Jack and the and the crew. I I tried. I solved all the problems that happened, but I never sat in the theater. Did you have any major problems uh, on the show? Oh, you always have problems with the with the Jack Benny show because the producer was uh, Hilliard Marks, who was Jack Benny's wife's brother who knew nothing about show business at all. And he would try to pretend that he was the big man on the show. But the advertising agents, I knew them all. You know, I grew up with them. They'd had a problem with Jack or with him, they, with him, that they'd want Jack to do a commercial for him. He would say no. And of course, they wouldn't tell me that already spoke to him. So I'd go to Jack and say, Jack, it's a good idea to do the commercial here and blah, blah, blah. And he'd do it. Then Hickey would be angry, come to the agency, how could you do that? I told you no. He said, well, Burl said it was okay. So he got after me, he said, you have no right to tell him that. I said, if I don't have any right, Hickey, tell Jack, don't tell me. So he always had a problem with him. But he got over it. So you had to be a master diplomat. Well, either be master diplomat or know your strength. He, he tried to attack the director of the show for giving the advertising agencies time to rehearse a commercial. And he went to Ralph Levy and he said, Ralph, he said, I'm the producer, you can't do that. Ralph Levy said, look, Burl's my agent. He tells me to do it, I do it. Whatever Burl does, says me to do, I do. If you don't like what he tells me, you go talk to Jack Benny or talk to him, but don't talk to me. <laughs> Those are little minor things you have. 